Bassett. We're at Shriekfest, the 18th year. We've got thrillers and horrors and sci-fis, shorts and features, all kinds of amazing stuff. Oh, blah, stuff. blah, blah. <laughs> she goes on and on. <laughs> Hello. It's Denise Gossett. I've been doing Shriekfest since I was 12 and you were 27. So Hi. it's been good. <laughs> no, 17, 17. Shriekfest, the pinnacle of my pretty much my career. This is it. That's sad. Shriekfest. This is what we all aspire to. Shriekfest. Is this a particularly scary, violent, gory year, you think, or is it more cerebral? There's a lot of cerebral, but there are a few that are gory. This is how they could get their break. Someone could see this film, like my company, exactly. and we might pick it up for distribution. And you will. And we will. What's different about the Shriekfest Film Festival is it's a little more laid back and kind of like a fun party event as opposed to being really business-based. Right, and so it's not snobby. It's not it's snobby. This is Lydia. Lydia. She's our co-host. Hello. You remember Denise? Yes. I do. Yes. How are you? I'm great. Oh yeah, Denise is great. She always puts on a great show. Yes. You haven't been to Shriekfest before, or have you? I have been, but not for a couple of years. And this year, I got to watch movies, so I got to kind of be like a judge. Yeah. You ever see Clock Clockwork Orange? Yeah, of course. Remember when they held the guy's eyes open with the toothpicks? Yes. That's what it's like. You're <laughs> shivering by the end of this. You're not allowed to talk about the movies yet that you looked at. I mean, if I wanted to find I'm out not. if something stood out or whatever. I'm not. No, and a couple of people would say, why don't I come over and help you watch movies? They'd say, you can't do that. That's, I'll get kicked off the jerk. No, no, no. What makes a great horror movie? Good characters. Um, I think it has to be well shot. They have to have a real sense of creating that dread and a twist. At least one good, really scary twist. And I'm a big jumper. I really like to go, ah! <laughs> 90% of the features that play at Shriekfest get distribution. They're that good. The things that, the movies that come out of this festival are top-notch. They're amazing, and I'm Definitely. very excited to get to be here. Hey, Corpsey here on the dead carpet at Shriekfest, and I'm with the terrific director, Dylan Narang. Did I pronounce that? You did. Brilliant? You got it. You got it. Thanks, and, Corpsey. And the star of your movie, which is called? Soundwave. Soundwave, I'm in, and I'm trying to remember the name. And I was involved in distributing uh, your All I Need. Yes. So it's nice that we're still talking. It's nice that we're still talking. It could have gone any way, but at least we're talking. How would you explain this movie, Soundwave? Kind of about a really smart kid who develops this device that lets him hear into the past and what happens when some bad guys finds out and what they want to do with it. I wanted to make like a sci-fi noir, um, some sort of like crime movie or, or something just in that kind of space, that kind of genre space. This, this guy, we found him, I don't know where he came from, he just, he kind of walked off the street and onto the set and we just said, you know what, let's just, let's just shoot it. We'll see what happens. Am I cut or am I going to be sitting you're in the You're in the movie. I'm you're still in the movie. movie. I worked with Dylan Narang a couple of years ago whenever his film All I Need uh, was at Shriekfest, and now he's pulled me in uh, for another small role in uh, Soundwave. A young uh, child prodigy is able to create a machine that is able to tap into the ether and pull any sound wave from recorded history in the past. So he can find out what happened with Marilyn Monroe and JFK, for, for instance, and be the fly on the wall. I'm being recorded right now. If other people are being recorded right now. Your phone is uh, recording you right now. Oh my God, I'm, I'm really, I'm really, stop it, man! Big Brother's watching you. I run fem, F-E-M underscore Godzilla at Instagram, where we follow our little genderqueer Godzilla here on all their tiny little adventures with Mothra and all the others. It's fun, but also raising awareness of how awesome Japanese creature features are. Cynthia, now in, on VOD, That's Lionsgate right. Digital has put That's it right. out. That's right, and Cynthia's a great movie. You gotta go in and you have to drink, and then oh. we get you drunk, and then you come back out and we do a more interview. But I don't drink. I, I, could, I could act really stupid, though. <laughs> I can do that no problem with no alcohol involved. It's a great event, so I'm happy to be here. I've been placing and winning in other contests and stuff, but uh, Shriekfest is like one that I've always like held out for, and this is great. It's, it's, I'm just happy Welcome to be here. Back. This is our first film at Shriekfest. We're very excited to premiere it for the first horror film festival. Both being fans of horror, this is an awesome opportunity to get some exposure to that. But last year we won Best Screenplay uh, Short. If I don't win, I'm going to be really, 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 really depressed. I was uh, happy enough to get to work with uh, Robert Ryan in a movie called Bus Party to Hell, which uh, Ben starred in, which Wonderful. is uh, yes, on Redbox yes, yes. now. Awesome. And they're in final post on a new horror movie called Art of the Dead with Tara Reid and um, 
uh, Richard Grieco. All right, we're opening Shriekfest 2018. 2018. Can't wait. And we can't wait. Support yes. uh, Shriekfest and Denise personally and uh, the young independent filmmakers coming up. Taking my job. I'll try not to cry when I hand up. <laughs> Stop. <laughs> I do not cry. I do not. See you at the awards. Ever since I was a little girl, I wanted a baby of my own. A baby that's part of both of us. Good news. Looks like you're gonna have twins. Twins as in, um, twins as in two babies. Uh, oh my God, you're bleeding. Uh, am I gonna lose my baby? Oh no, no, everything's fine. You're just relaxed. <gasps> it moved. What is going on here today? We got three dead bodies in one night in the same hospital. This crime is here. This is different. What, honey, what? Something's not right. No, look, she's fine. She's all cozy and all quiet. should have moved back to Shady Grove.